Right guys, welcome to another update. Um, as you can see here, the crossover is finished. Um, soldered, ready to be worked, all the wiring's done. Um, one little problem we might have, but it probably won't crop up, is locations of the holes for the point motors. I'm hoping we can measure out the differences work it from here but I'm thinking of having it behind this post here if you can see right there it's a perfect spot just to have both really and we can start the incline as soon as the uh, junctions are in and reverse loop so that'll be fun so we'll just show you how to mark the holes out for these baseboards and take it from here so what we want is an accurate measurement of where the tracks are going to be and where to make the cuts for the point motors, making as little holes as possible because obviously this is going to be in full view and every little detail counts, including the ballast. Let's push it along here and about here. Oh, no, this is upside down for the reason. Because Zoom in. See the markings, yeah, those are the cut areas. Hopefully it'll work first time, we don't want to make too much of a mess. Right, if we go over there next, make sure these are located over their holes properly.
things to check before we make the cuts. Could probably move this. Yeah. This is the clearance. perfect position to be honest. So there's our to work out clearance limits. Just make it, I think. Only just we need some minor modifications, but see that how close that is. It's not that old. Right, now the fun part. Get some holes in here. to the edge.
Get out of the other hole. I've seen a 